six foot related symptoms suggesting liver trouble. I must emphasize the criticality of liver diseases, including cirrhosis and liver cancer, which are leading causes of mortality worldwide, accounting for approximately 2 million deaths annually. These diseases can be insidiously asymptomatic in their initial stages, making early detection challenging. When symptoms do become apparent, it often indicates that the disease has progressed to an advanced stage. It might be surprising to learn that early indicators of liver dysfunction can occasionally be identified through changes in the lower extremities. Seemingly minor or unrelated symptoms in the legs could serve as early warning signs of a liver condition. This is video we will provide an in-depth analysis of these symptoms. Our goal is to empower viewers with knowledge to recognize these early signs, thereby enhancing awareness and facilitating proactive measures for liver health preservation. Sign number one, unpleasant foot odor. Unpleasant foot odor is often perceived as a simple hygiene issue, but it can actually be a telltale sign of deeper health concerns, particularly in relation to the body's toxin elimination processes. Our skin is not only a protective barrier but also plays a vital role in expelling toxins, primarily through sweat glands. These glands are instrumental in releasing toxins and metabolic byproducts, especially when the kidneys are underperforming. In cases where kidney function is compromised, the body attempts to compensate by enhancing toxin excretion through the skin. This intensified process can lead to a distinct and unpleasant foot odor. The health of the liver is closely linked to this occurrence. It is important to understand that all organs in the body are interconnected, thus, a disorder in the liver is likely to impact other organs, such as the kidneys. Liver diseases, known for causing toxin buildup and impairing blood circulation, can adversely affect the kidneys and other organs. Therefore, an unpleasant foot odor should not be overlooked, as it might indicate underlying liver issues, signaling the body's increased dependence on skin excretion mechanisms due to compromised liver and kidney functions. Sign number two, nail fungus. Nail fungus, or onychomycosis, is a condition identifiable through specific changes in nail appearance, such as discoloration, rough texture, splitting, loss of shine, presence of white spots, or flaky skin around the feet. These symptoms may not only indicate a fungal infection but could also point to underlying liver health issues. The link between nail fungus and liver health is substantial. Individuals with compromised liver function often experience an imbalance in their gut microbiome, which can manifest in various conditions, including nail fungus and other skin-related issues like dandruff and seborrheic dermatitis. A significant study published in 2009 in the Journal of the European Academy of Dermatology and Venereology highlighted the increased prevalence of nail fungus in individuals suffering from liver cirrhosis and viral hepatitis B and C. This correlation emphasizes the need to view nail fungus not merely as a cosmetic concern but as a possible indicator of more serious health complications particularly those related to liver health. Recognizing and addressing nail fungus may provide critical insights into an individual's overall liver function and general health. Sign number three, erythema. Erythema, defined by its characteristic skin redness, can be a crucial indicator in the evaluation of liver health. While it's commonly linked with parasitic infections, such as worm infestations, its causes extend beyond these. In the realm of liver diseases, erythema frequently appears as a symptom. This includes a spectrum of conditions like cirrhosis, acute viral or autoimmune hepatitis, and diseases affecting the gallbladder. It's critical to recognize that erythema is not a standalone symptom, rather, it often signals more serious underlying health issues. Specifically in liver diseases, 
erythema may manifest as the body's response to various complications or deteriorating liver function. Furthermore, it's important to acknowledge that erythema can also arise from adverse drug reactions. Statistically, 1 in 10 such reactions can lead to severe liver intoxication. This underscores the importance of considering erythema not just as a skin condition, but potentially as a symptom of more severe health concerns, particularly in relation to liver function. Sign number 4, Itching The sensation of itching in the lower part of the feet, while often dismissed as a minor discomfort, can actually serve as a significant indicator of chronic liver diseases. This symptom is particularly common in conditions related to impaired bile duct function and obstructed bile flow. A notable example is primary biliary cirrhosis, a specific type of liver disease, where approximately 70% of affected individuals report experiencing itching in the feet or palms. This itching is primarily caused by the buildup of bile salts under the skin and an increase in histamine levels. Normally, the liver processes and eliminates bile efficiently. However, when liver function is compromised, bile salts may accumulate, leading to pronounced itching sensations. This symptom, therefore, is not just a source of discomfort but potentially signifies a more severe underlying liver condition. Recognizing and addressing this symptom is crucial in the assessment and management of overall liver health. Sign number 5. Reddish-brown spots on your legs. The appearance of reddish-brown spots on the legs, particularly below the knees, warrants attention as it may be indicative of underlying health concerns. These spots, often small and varying in size, may exhibit a chain-like pattern and show a noticeable shine under direct light. Their presence is commonly associated with problems in blood circulation and a decline in vascular health. Such skin changes can be a sign of liver insufficiency, a condition characterized by reduced blood pressure in the arteries and the enlargement of blood vessels. In the context of liver diseases like hepatitis, these distinctive spots may emerge either shortly after the initial infection or as the illness evolves into a chronic state. Recognizing these skin changes is vital as they can act as early warning signs of serious liver-related health issues. It is important for individuals to be vigilant about such symptoms and to seek medical evaluation and intervention, as these spots can provide crucial insights into the overall state of liver health and general well-being. Sign number 6. Swelling of the Feet Swelling or edema in the feet is a notable symptom often linked to liver diseases. This condition, marked by the accumulation of fluid within the tissues, is readily identifiable. A key characteristic is when pressure applied to the swollen area with a finger leaves a lasting indentation, which slowly reverts to its normal state. This symptom, typically more pronounced in the evening or after physical exertion, is considered a later stage sign associated with conditions like portal hypertension or a reduction in albumin levels. In cases of cirrhosis, where normal blood flow through the liver is obstructed, swollen feet are a common observation. This obstruction leads to increased pressure in the portal vein, subsequently causing fluid to accumulate in the legs and abdomen. Additionally, swollen feet can also signal kidney-related issues, such as nephrotic syndrome, which may arise as a secondary complication of viral liver inflammations like hepatitis. The close relationship between the health of the liver and the swelling of the feet highlights the significance of this symptom. It is essential to recognize and address such swelling, as it can be a marker of serious liver or kidney conditions necessitating prompt medical attention and intervention. Awareness of liver damage symptoms is crucial, and understanding the causes of liver problems is equally important. Let's explore the common causes and then delve into five steps to help repair and restore your liver. Firstly, 
Consuming alcoholic beverages damages hepatic liver cells, as the liver is tasked with removing alcohol from your blood. Another significant cause of liver damage is the excessive intake of sugar, refined grains, and carbohydrates, which contribute to non-alcoholic fatty liver disease, often accompanied by weight gain around the stomach. Additionally, certain medications and painkillers, including statins and antibiotics, can harm the liver and kidneys due to their role in chemical removal from the blood. Moreover, common vegetable oils, margarines, and salad dressings, typically made from highly processed seed oils, can cause substantial inflammation in the liver. Replacing these with healthier fats like extra virgin olive oil or raw coconut oil is advisable. Lastly, a diet high in protein and low in vegetables can exacerbate liver damage by causing a buildup of nitrogen waste. To learn more about this topic, please like the video and subscribe to my Healthy Care channel. I want to express my gratitude once again for your viewership and support in watching this video today. I send my best wishes for you to always be safe, prosperous, and happy.